Good afternoon and welcome to today's game between the Greater Latrobe Lady Wildcats and the Franklin Regional Lady Panthers. Before the pivotal section game, I had the chance to catch up with Hayden Kranick about the team's game against Armstrong on Monday and how to get back in the win column at Franklin Regional. With an overall record of 10-2 and two and a section record of 5-2, and two, how do you guys build on your strong start and how do you get ready for playoffs? Um, we work together. We always try to lift each other up and then make sure that we're always performing to make like a good outcome for each game and just like work on a clean slate every game. Now that you're a senior, what responsibilities did that come with that? Um, being a senior, it's like important that we all have a positive attitude and just like come to practice in games every day with like looking to motivate the underclassmen and just work together for everybody to have like a good day and good game. And then as a close-knit team, how do you use that chemistry on and off the field? Um, we always try to just show up and have fun and make the game fun because if we're not having fun, it's just not a great time. And Congrats on signing with Erskine. How has the season prepared you for it? Showing up every day it just reminds me that I'm here to work and also just get better as a person and an athlete and also as a teammate and just prepare me for future games in college and things like that. And then ahead of tonight's game against Franklin Regional, how do you rebound from the game against Armstrong and get back on track? Um, we just got to pretend like it never happened just remember keep our eyes forward and just remember that we're a good team and we can we can rebound and come back it's everything's in the like future we can't change anything from the past so thank you and good luck with the rest of your season and your upcoming season in college thank you additionally richard Hayward caught up with senior captain josie striggers prior to tonight's game now josie after monday's game against armstrong how important is it to regroup quickly and how do you do that I think really we just need to all come together as a team and realize that it was just one game and come back stronger than ever and fight through the rest of the season, get ready for playoffs. Now this year, this team has exceeded heights that were expected at the beginning of the season. What has allowed you guys to maintain success throughout the entire season? I think really that our hard work through everything that we all do and the team chemistry just helps us to build as a team and work together very well. Now you and Kayla feature the two-headed pitching monster that you guys have. What is your connection like with Kayla and what do you attribute that to? Me and Kayla are really good friends on and off the field. So I think just supporting each other on the mound and having each other's backs really just helps us. We've been pitchers pitching with each other since forever. So I think just being with each other and knowing that we have each other's back is very good. Now with this year's team being primarily senior led and having the amount of commits that you have this year, what has allowed you guys or you seniors and the commits to have the success that you have as far as leadership and skill goes? I think being a good player can only go so much. Like, you need to be able to have leadership and control the team and help them and know that you care about them. And I think this year that all the seniors and even juniors and everybody, we all care about each other and we all want the best for each other. So I think leadership is very good this year. Now the heart of your guys' lineup really stands out as far as a game-by-game -game basis and production-wise. What has allowed you guys to create that production and help you guys win games? I think that we all really want to hit the ball when we get up there, but we also know how to adjust to umpires and what they're calling and stuff. And we need base runners more than anything. And I think we not all know how to get on base to get those base runners. Now, last year, you guys made it to the second round of the playoffs. And as playoffs near, how much has it fueled you guys to get back to the point where you left off last year with this group in particular? I think we had unfinished business last year. I think that we're coming out strong this year. We really want to get as far as we can. We have a very good team this year, and I think every girl on this team could attribute to winning and doing everything that we can to make it far in playoffs. Now this afternoon, you guys get Franklin Regional on the road for a pivotal section game and critical in this stretch for you guys as of late. How important is it for you guys to go to Franklin and come out with a critical road win? It's very important that we come out with a win tonight. I think that we're all determined. We're all hungry for a win after Monday's game. I think we need to show everybody that that was not the team that we are. And this tonight's game is very important. Josie, thank you. Thank you.